Hey guys, this is Mike the Scrapper. Today I'm gonna to scrap this commercial coffee maker. I'm gonna show you what's inside and how much does everything weigh. Now this is what the inside of it looks like. Now you notice it's steel, and you notice the magnet does not attract. I'll show you that in a few minutes. Now this piece here that you see, I'd call this a thermostat. This was in the water. Look how that's nicely corroded there. But this is number two copper. Now this is the tank that all the water gets put in before it gets in your coffee. Now this is a coffee maker and it should have a filter like this. This coffee maker did not. Now look what's in there. That's the heating element, the ones with the coffee. Now look what else I found. This was in where your coffee comes out of. You put the water in there and it comes out. That's what I found in there. That looks like calcium and some other stuff. Now this is what it looks like when it's taken apart. Here you have non-magnetic stainless steel, a piece of aluminum you have some steel up here, some heating elements, some brass, some wire. Now I'm going to show you how to tell the difference between steel and non-magnetic stainless steel. As you can see, the magnet is not attracting, but it's not aluminum. You put it to a grinder, you see the sparks? Trying to get a better attempt here. See that sparking? That's steel. So it doesn't attract to a magnet, but it does spark. It's called non-magnetic stainless steel. Now this is a piece of aluminum. See how it's not sparking? That's aluminum. That's how you can tell the difference between non-magnetic stainless steel and aluminum. The coffee maker itself weighed 18 pounds. The non-magnetic stainless steel comes in at 10 pounds. The aluminum, 0.7 ounces. The steel, we have about five pounds. Number two copper, one ounce. The heating elements, 10 ounces. The brass, 0.7 ounces. The wire, nine ounces.
All right, guys, this is Mike the Scrapper. This is what's in a commercial coffee maker. Please comment, like, subscribe. Till then, guys, peace.